Welcome, my name is Chris Johansson with the City of Des Moines Community Development Department. And today I'm here with Lance Henning, Executive Director of the Greater Des Moines Habitat for Humanity. And we're here to talk about the unique partnership they have with the City of Des Moines. Well, thank you for uh, having us here today. Thanks, Lance. Recently, Habitat for Humanity completed their 200th home build, which is very exciting. And Lance, if you don't mind, please tell us a little bit about that partnership with the city that enabled Habitat to accomplish that. Uh, we've been excited to be able to work with the community to be able to do 200 houses with low-income homeowners and that uh, the city has been a very important partner with Habitat for Humanity. Uh, we've worked with the city in a number of ways and uh, in the funding side uh, the city has helped us uh, to create 135 of those 200 homes and, and being able to do that, that uh, every dollar that the city's helped Habitat with we've been able to leverage that four to one create more than 15 million dollars of housing. Very impressive. Um, Lance, many, many people are, are familiar with Habitat's home build program. Can you talk a little bit about some of the other programs that Habitat for Humanity is doing in the neighborhoods to help with revitalization? Yeah, uh, the home building side, we're working with homeowners that are earning less than 60% of the area median income, and they do sweat equity with Habitat, and then we provide a no-interest mortgage, and volunteers from the community help build the houses. And then our other programs, uh, working on the housing, we have our Rock the Block program where we are doing uh, critical repair and home repair on existing homeowners, uh, trying to work with uh, other houses in the neighborhood to be able to uplift the entire area. And then one of the exciting ones that I'm not sure a lot of folks know about is our tool lending library. It's in the Habitat Restore and it provides tools uh, for folks to be able to do uh, projects on their own house. So if they're doing home maintenance, home repair, uh, it's things that uh, just being able to have access to the tools and when you call it a tool lending library, that's exactly what it is. So with a small membership fee, folks can come and check out tools. And then the Habitat Restore, and hopefully people have checked that out. It's over at East Euclid, 9235. And uh, that is, uh, we like to think of it as the ultimate home improvement outlet, but it's a great value on building materials or if someone has a, a building material that they would like to donate, they can donate that to Habitat, the Habitat Restore, and then everything that we generate off the Restore is invested back in the neighborhoods and invested back into housing. That is great. That Restore is a great resource for the community. For a lot of your, your, your programs and your projects that you do in the, do, do in the neighborhood, how, what role does the community have in accomplishing those goals for Habitat? Uh, partnership is extremely important for Habitat for Humanity and the way we build. Uh, partners like the City of Des Moines have been uh, and, and helping us in the way we plan and address and, and go after making a difference in the neighborhoods. And then just the general community be able to work with us. So we'll have about 12,000 volunteers that'll work with Habitat for Humanity this year. Um, and then it doesn't matter if it's a corporation, a church, or an individual, we would encourage them to come on out and join with us to be able to make a difference in housing and change neighborhoods. Well, that's outstanding, Lance. After the 200 homes have been built, what's next for Habitat? Well, we hope that we can continue to uh, build the partnerships and keep building bridges. So we often like to talk about that uh, we're more than just building houses. And when we talk about that, we're thinking about how we can be a bridge to help uh, get folks together and make a difference uh, in the city of Des Moines and make a difference in housing and neighborhoods. And so we're looking at how we can do the next 500 houses and looking at how we can make a difference uh, really change a neighborhood. So we, we think of Habitat's program as uh, building homes, community, and hope. And so that's really what we want to be about is, is changing neighborhoods and, and changing through home ownership and just uh, providing hope for folks that otherwise might not have that opportunity. Well, Lance, I think you know your partnership with the city has been greatly appreciated. I think you've helped the city accomplish great efforts towards revitalization of a lot of our neighborhoods, and we wish you continued success with that as well. Well, thanks for your great partnership. Yep. Thank you very much.